Someone's secret must be told. Who's Lisa Grayson? Theodore. A new episode of The Listener. Tonight at 10, 9 central on CTV. The day's top stories from your local news leader for news, weather, sports, and everything in between. When you need to know, there's only one place to go. CTV News, weeknights at 6. Gliding towards greatness, the Bridget McQuest claim in the National Aboriginal Hockey Championships is exactly that, a step towards Olympic gold. What's your personal dream accomplishment as a hockey player? To play on the senior women's team in the Olympics. Girls hockey has come a long ways. It's very exciting to be a role model for young aboriginals, and that's my dream. The Vancouver 2010 Winter Olympic Games are coming to CTV. Do you believe? Get in motion. Is your get up and go gone? Bring it back by joining a fitness class or sports team. The challenge will keep you active, and new friends will keep you interested. Find out how you can get in motion today. And you're okay with the tile in the master bathroom, right? It's paler than I thought. Well, then we'll rip it out. No. No. No, I'd rather deal with paler for the next 20 years than this house not to be done on time. Hey, can we go visit my Yes, we can. Oh, I'm well, ready. Hold on, not so fast. I, 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 I can't let your mother go because we have a lot of work Jackson. to do still. No, no, no. How would you like to go over to the quarter mains in the hotel limo? Can I have a soda and watch a movie? Of course you can. I also think that it has a video gaming system in it now. So you're awesome. Way over there. Think you can find your way back down to the front desk? I've only done it like 50 million times. All right, go, go, go. Marty, it's Jax. Did you get the hotel limo ready? Uh, Morgan's going to go over to the quarter mates. He's on your way down. Thanks. That was smooth. Yes, and we're just talking about giving it Michael space. I know, but I was thinking how teenagers have a short attention span, and Michael probably doesn't even remember that I was there this morning. Oh, that's a stretch. That, that, that is a stretch, even for you. I'm having such a hard time with this. I am. I, Michael and I were so close, and now we don't get along. We're not connecting. And the quartermains, you know, I know the quartermains are driving him crazy, and he probably yes. wants to talk to me and tell me how okay. he's feeling. Carly? So I should go over there so he can. You gotta trust me. You think you can do that? Thanks, Grandpa. Man, he's pretty intense. Oh, 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 well, I'm, I'm glad you liked your physical therapist, huh? Yeah, Dan said he could come every day. He's pretty expensive, but... Don't worry about the cost. I'm very happy to pay for it. Did, did you call with the car? Mm-hmm. It's all taken care of. Hey. Are, are you all right, son? Monica! Monica, come here immediately. Don't you move. You just sit there. Monica! What is the matter? Oh, that damn therapist pushed Michael too hard. What therapist? The one I hired to supervise Michael's oh, training. Oh, Edward, you fool. Well, I was only trying to help. Help like that? He's going to put him right back in the hospital. on the lake, just the two of us. No Sonny and Claudia barging in whenever they want. We can leave tomorrow. Mm. That would be nice. But I gotta take a pass. Mm. Too much too soon. No, 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 no. No, no it's just I promised on pain of death that I would uh, go to Bensonhurst this weekend and have lunch with my son at my parents' house. Mm. Well... I miss you. Yeah. Wow. But it sounds like you'll have fun. Yeah. I gotta admit. Get together with my family are really something. It's like classic old school Italian, you know, the big yeah. meal in the middle of the day. When I say big, I mean like Roman emperor's feasts. And I wonder when I'll 400 pounds. <laughs> Cousin Violet is pushing it. Are they all as outgoing as you are? <laughs> outgoing? That's a nice euphemism. Um, yeah, it's pretty much wall-to-wall um, -wall type A personalities. You would have a blast. <laughs> Which is, um, that's probably my cue to invite you along. No, 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 I get it. I understand why you can't.
we need to discuss what happened here. Sure. Okay. Would you mind turning that off and looking at me, please? reason to be but you shouldn't have shown molly that blog because she's too young to understand the hateful things that they said about me you're her older sister you need to protect her no matter how angry you are at me you know scan the blocks for molly gone can i go now no sit <sighs> what is wrong with you why are you acting this way? What happened to the thoughtful, compassionate, mature daughter that I could always count on? Maybe she changed when she found out her mom slept with a married man. I was convinced that the mayor killed Brownie Hughes, but it just seems so neat, you know, so tied up in a little bow. I'm afraid that I've missed something. Well, go back to the beginning. Okay, well... The beginning for me was when Patrick and I were called to the Metro Court Hotel room. Brianna was there, she was unconscious, and Mayor Floyd was frantic. He said that they had been taking a shower together and she hit her head once, not twice, like the autopsy showed. Do you believe it? It's certainly possible he didn't know about it. And he did leave the hotel room and then come back, which would leave room for somebody else to have hit her over the head. Keep going. What does your instinct tell you? If he was telling the truth about what happened to Brianna, then maybe he's also telling the truth about the fact that he planned to marry her. Which would mean the person with the most to lose is the mayor. Just, you know, just the person I was looking for. I wanted to thank you again for all your help. How exactly have I helped you? Creature made from the darkest I call veterans. I call Rainbow Song. Only those of noble blood could serve as a knight. Bending the rules. This is your seal of nobility, but it's a lie. Our new knight, Sir Lancelot. But when the future of Camelot is threatened. I don't have magic that powerful. Tis your destiny, then. And magic may be the only answer. Code bends for no man. Then the code is wrong. A new episode of Merlin. Sunday at 8, 7 central on CT. Read it. It's the June biggest one-day sale this Saturday only. Second, 2009. Save 40% off every sofa when you buy the matching love seat and chair. Save 50% off this sort of perfect Using night the guitar cords, mattress set only G7 9 and 30 fabulous bedroom and dining room sets at just $9.99 or less. There's no GST on appliances and home electronics. Plus, you don't pay for 15 months. This Saturday only at The Brick. Check the big internet flyer online now at thebrick.com. Don't soak yourself this song is going to be called wet repellent stay dry with all family care smoothened just as she was talking about her she showed up oh! just as she was talking about her she showed up just as she was talking about talking about her Talking to that police authority, policeman, telling her his, his hunch was becoming true when she started talking about how the most likely suspect was really her. And just as she was talking about her, she walks in, and so they shut up. He moves away from her like a big old truck And then she speaks to her 